Sing Street is a film about a young man who has been taken out of his Jesuit school in Dublin and put into a less affluent and um, more kind of working class school and he's kind of trying to find his way through it and find a way to be creative and unique and expressive and at the same time not uh, catch a beating off any of the other kids. So, um, you know, the backdrop is that his family is kind of going through a difficult period and there's some quite tenuous relationships and, um, you know, it's just about this kid is trying to find his way through his teenage years. Brendan's the older brother of Connor and uh, he's like a complete stoner and he sits up in his room all day every day just listening to LPs and not doing much. And I think it's a result of the relationship that he's had with his parents and the things he wanted to do and the restrictions that they put on him have kind of pushed him a little further down this path. So in a way he acts as kind of like this sage-like character for Connor and um, he kind of introduces him to all this music and culture and tries to help him to define his ideas and his opinions about the relationships that he's having in his life and the girls and all these different things. And uh, also there's an element of Brennan living vicariously through his younger brother too. John is a person who likes to have a lot of liberty on a set and we would just sit there playing music, chatting, hanging out, bouncing little ideas around um, and for the family scenes I think that with Aiden and Maria yeah, that's a funny one I think because we've all grown up kind of watching the Late Late Show you know when we're kids on Friday nights with our families and we kind of understand the dynamics of an Irish family at the dinner table uh, it all came quite naturally to us and we, in a way, just knew where the cues were to pick up off one another. Um, and of course, uh, Aidan and Maria are just really great, you know, veteran actors who really have this kind of thing down and they were really excellent in those scenes. And then you've got, uh, you know, Kelly and Ferdia who are two very good young actors in their own right and... You know, they were really capable of taking on those scenes as well, making them feel authentic. So I think they really did in the end. You know, he knew that he needed to look a little bit disheveled and a little bit, uh, you know, introverted. Um, and we wanted him to be just a little bit kind of like scraggly and kind of unshaven and stuff like that, you know what I mean? Just to give the sense that he'd been up there for a while and that he was struggling to get through this part of his life, do you know what I mean? Um, and so I think that that really plays in the film as well. I think the character looks the part, certainly.